Hallie's fans have always expressed not liking her dating DDG and felt like she was too good for DDG. But Hallie is a little ratchet, okay? She can really, you know, be away. <laughs> but it's a case of the quote-unquote good girl wanting the bad boy and DDG wanting to give the good girl a try. I will say sometimes people do have a way of seeing things in relationships that others don't see in their own relationships. So I agree with Hallie's fans that DDG was left field, uh, a left field choice for her. So baby, when you ready, hit my line. Tell me what you want to do. I know you still really do, do, do. Hey you guys, before we get into today's video, I just want to take time, as I always do, to thank all of my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for supporting my channel. If you're not already currently subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button right now. Also, I do have another channel called Brandy Beer Review TV. Navigate to the first comment pinned to the top to check that out. Also, like the video, you guys. Comment on the video. I want to hear your thoughts, so comment and like. Um, and now let's get into this juicy topic. In today's celebrity couple toxic news, we are talking about DDG and Hallie breaking up. In case you've missed it, according to People Magazine, in a statement shared to DDG's Instagram stories on Thursday, October 3rd, DDG, who is 26 years old, wrote, Dear friends and supporters, after much reflection and heartfelt conversations, Hallie and I have decided to go our separate ways decision was not easy, but we believe it's the best path forward for both of us. I cherish the time we've spent together and the love we've shared. He says this, despite the changes in our relationship, our love for each other remains deep and true. We are still best friends and adore each other. DDG born Daryl Dwayne Granberry Jr. continued. The pair who were first romantically involved in January 2022, welcomed son Halo in late 2023. DDG said that moving forward, he and the Little Mermaid star, who is 24 years old, will focus on their individual journeys and share roles as co-parents as they cherish the bond they've built and the beautiful moments they've shared. He then asked fans for understanding and support as they navigate this transition. He says, thank you for your love and encouragement. DDG continued. In August 2022, shortly after going public with their romance, Bailey said she was for sure in love with the I'm Geeked rapper. She said this, I grew up being on YouTube and would always see the young black creators and was constantly inspired by them, she said. In Essence's September-October 2022 cover story, and she said he was one of them. She continued, I completely forgot about him, but then I saw that he was dropping music and I really gravitated toward this one song. Coincidentally, he messaged me and the rest is history. Here's how people are reacting to this news. Someone said this, I feel like when a couple breaks up right after a pregnancy, postpartum played a part. Someone else said, I'm not saying she should give up on, a, on love but she's the one that needs to believe a little less in it. Somebody said, super sad, this is so common within the first year after the birth of the first child. People gotta get tools on how to navigate through uncharted relationship spaces. Someone else said this, the sooner we all accept that it's okay to spend chapters of our life with someone and learn to be better for a new chapter, the easier things will be. I do think if a relationship can last forever until you die at age 99, it is great, but we can't predict the future and I don't see breakups as a waste of time. People who break up after 30 years didn't waste time 30 years. I think the goal should be to just meet someone and treat them good while you are with them. And if your flame burns out, exit in a healthy way. Be glad you both got to experience each other and had a good time and move on. Wow, that was a good one. Someone else said this, this have a baby and breakup cycle got to stop in our community culture. I can't stand it. 
Someone else said, a man couldn't convince me to have his child in 2024. Someone else said, why did she even get him pregnant? I think they meant her. <laughs> Someone else said, unfortunately, most men don't understand postpartum and aren't taught how to love, respect, support, and care for their women during that phase of the relationship. I'm not saying this is their situation, but it's high key the only thing that makes sense in regard to couples splitting so quickly after a baby. Someone else said, first of all, he plays way too much. I don't trust nothing he say. They probably giggling typing this. People are thinking that after Hallie had the baby, this is the reason behind DDG and Hallie's breakup. And I am inclined to agree. According to nct.org.uk, a baby can cause many changes to your life, including physical changes. Your body will change in many, many ways, including your clothing size, hormonal changes, your hormone levels will change, and it can take three to six months for them to return to normal. Relationship changes. Your relationships with your partner, family, and friends will change. You'll be re-establishing who you are as a couple and you may need to communicate with your partner about what's going on. Priorities change. Your priorities will change and you'll need to balance being a parent with other aspects of your life. Sex life. Your sex life may change temporarily. You may need to wait a few weeks after giving birth before having sex and it may hurt for a while. Learning. You'll learn new skills and love in a new way. You guys, the changes described in the article can significantly impact a relationship after the birth of a child that if both people are not mature enough to handle could end in a breakup or divorce. Now, DDG did say in his announcement, the breakup announcement, that despite the changes in the relationship, he and Hallie still love each other. Those changes to me translate to after baby, things are now a lot different and pretty much that's the reason for the breakup right there. You know, men after childbirth, the man will often feel neglected in the relationship and question why their woman is spending so much time with the baby instead of with them. And I'm sure this is how DDG felt towards Hallie but men need to give the, the women more grace to deal with these changes. But I will say also that it is important for women to also work to balance the changes as well. I know not too long ago, Hallie posted she needed some me time. So she was probably trying to figure it out then, spending quality time with her son and mentally processing the changes. Hallie's fans have always expressed not liking her dating DDG and felt like she was too good for DDG, but Hallie is a little ratchet, okay? She can really, you know, be away. <laughs> but it's a case of the quote unquote good girl wanting the bad boy and DDG wanting to give the good girl a try. I will say sometimes people do have a way of seeing things in relationships that others don't see in their own relationship. So I agree with Hallie's fans that DDG was left field, uh, a left field choice for her. Hallie's persona is sweet and innocent. She's the little mermaid for goodness sake. And DDG is a bad boy, ratchet rapper, clout chasing YouTuber. So I get it. I get where Hallie's fans are coming from. Why haven't we heard from Hallie? We know that Hallie is a very private person, but it's just strange she hasn't said anything at all. I mean, when they finally introduced their son to the world, she wasn't quiet on that, but now she's quiet as a church mouse. I feel like she's probably over it. DDG is always posting their son, always doing something that draws attention, and that's probably one of the reasons Hallie probably lost interest in him. I don't think Hallie and DDG's breakup is a publicity stunt. I think the breakup is real. However, I also don't think this is truly the end of the road for them. I mean, they have a child together, so they still have to be around each other. So who knows? They may find their way back to each other. And if not, that's okay as well. They're young. They will be just fine. Anyways, what did you guys think of today's celebrity toxic video? Why do you think Hallie hasn't said anything about the breakup? 
Do you think the breakup is real? Leave a comment and be sure to like the video and share it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hi guys. Don't forget to click that subscribe button. It lets me know you're enjoying the content I'm creating for you. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.